Okay, wake up, you lazy bitch. God, I hate Caitlyn. Ugh. Worst Elite Four ever. Now I'm gonna take on Caitlyn, my least favorite. How are you? How impudent you dare are to disturb my sleep? Ugh. You appear to possess a combination of strength and kindness. Very well. Make your best effort not to bore me with a yawn-inducing battle, Claire. Yeah, you mother fucking. I'm. T Ooh, I will show you a not sleep-inducing battle, and then I will do inappropriate things on that bed behind you. Okay, so she starts off with her reunique list. I have one of those. I send out Dracula because Bug beats Psychic, and I am gonna set up. While this thing's out, Swords Dance, so I can swap her team. My attack sharply raises. Psychic, ouch! Oh my god, how psychedelic. Oh my god, that did a lot of damage. Oh. Let's be faster than everything. Oh, she has a Sigilyph. That's going to be tricky. I, I'm calling that's coming out next. But anyway, so I take down the Reuniclus masterfully. And out comes the Sigilyph. Give me $20, everybody. Anyway, so Sigilyph comes out. I'm going to go with another X scissor. Oh, and I'm faster than it. Wonderful. Oh, but I didn't kill it. Oh, my God. But it didn't kill me. It missed. That is wonderfully marvelous. So she uses the full restore. And it restores the HP, of course. But I get off the X scissor. So we're right back where we started. Except that I kill it. I got a critical. Oh, my God. That works so well. So now the Sigilyph's down, the biggest threat to Dracula. So out comes Musharna. And I know I can easily take that. That's a slow thing. Actually, it has good defense, though, so we'll see how much I can do. Doesn't matter, though, because I've beaten the hump. I've taken down the hardest part. Took down the Musharna. Nothing can stand in my way now, unless her Gothitelle's really fast. So out comes Gothitelle, which for some reason isn't Psychic Dark. I mean, why is it even Psychic in the first place? But whatever, let's not get into that. If I'm at a time like this, I should stay cool and collected. Yeah, shut up. So I use X-Scissor, which should be doubly super effective, but it's not. Oh, well. And I still take it out. Nice sweep, Dracula. Good job. Dracula good 48. Two levels in one battle. As a trainer, you're both excellent and excellent. Your Pokemon have class. I'm very pleased to have battled you. Here's $6,000. Thanks, Caitlin. You suck. Gonna head. You're gonna give me head? Now it's time for the spooky, scary ghost types. Ooh. Eyes brimming with dark flame. This man rejected everything other than himself in order to bring about the one singular justice. That's part of a novel I'm writing. I was inspired by the challenger who was just here. Oh my god, that's N! And somehow I got a little sad. Excuse me, you're a challenger, right? Yeah. I'm the Elite Force Ghost-type Pokemon user, Chantal. Is that a name? And I shall be your opponent. Well, it's on then, Chantal. You're cool too, though. I, she has a good team. I hate, though, that like the Elite Four only have four Pokemon in these last two gens. Like, no, it's supposed to be five. Whatever, whatever. I just don't like that they've been gradually making the games easier. It's, it's, it's annoying. I want a challenge, man. So I send out Cap and Cock. He's been revived and uh, halfway well. And so how comes Cofagrigus, which you can't, you have to censor that name in this game to trade it because it contains an offensive word. And that was a crit and that did, still did absolutely nothing. This thing is a bulky maniac. I get hurt by my burn, which I have. And I'm just gonna use her slash and I'm gonna hurt the Cofagrigus. Oh my God, ugh. I'm doing like no damage and now I'm dead. I don't I don't really want to get mummied, you know? But then again, here's an idea. I'll send out Muffin Top, and once he uses Intimidate, he doesn't need his ability anyway, so he can have mummy. Yeah. So I'm gonna use Crunch. Crunch. And it dies. Oh no, mummy! Ah! But if I withdraw, I have to withdraw it to get Intimidate again anyway. And then when I withdraw it, its ability will be reset. So it's not so bad after all. So that's going to come Golurk. I'm going to send in my good pal, Kevin Bacon. Okay, so out is Kevin Bacon. And out comes Golurk. 
or Galark. So I'm going to use Scald, do some super effective water damage. Less than half. Oh my god, I am sucking the D. I avoid the Earthquake miraculously. Thanks, Bright Powder. It's actually paying off. I use another Scald, get it down to the heal zone, and it's burned. Beautiful. Beautiful. Let's see if I can survive this when I'm burned. No, it still kills me. So now she's going to get a free heal on this Golurk. I'm going to send out Dracula. Because he worked so well the last time. So she's going to heal, obviously. And so I'm going to take advantage of that. And boost my attack stat to hopefully do some damage. Man, dude, what's up? So now my attack is really high. I'm going to use Leaf Blade. And we'll see how that does. Oh, it kills it. Wonderful, beautiful, oh, marvelous, gorgeous. But out's going to come the deadly Chandelier. And I'm going to stay in because I'm insane. Let's go for the Aerial Ace. See how much that does. It does a decent amount with a crit. He uses Shadow Ball. It's like, fuck, I don't have to waste a Fire Blast on you. You're, like, dead already. And I go ahead and do die. So next, I'm going to send... I'm going to bring back out Muffin Top. And we're going to finish this thing off. Intimidate. Not that that matters. It's a special attacker. I use Crunch, but she uses a full restore, so we have to wait for that. Because priority. Hopefully I don't get burned. That would suck a whole lot. I did not get burned. Wonderful. So I'm going to use Crunch. Oh, it's faster than me. Oh, my God. Ah, Fire Blast. Oh. oh, my God. I lived it. Didn't even get burned. And I took the Chandelier down. Whew. That's a big relief. This thing, That thing is terrifying. <clears throat> and Muffin Top levels up. And I might as well keep her in for this last Jellicent. Ew, it's female Jellicent. One of the ugliest things ever. It seems this is the beginning of my final chapter. So I get off a of crunch. I guarantee it's going to curse body me. Yep. Always. 30% chance my ass. So it's going to kill me with a brine. <clears throat> At least it didn't use hydro pump ball. But yeah, so Muffin Top goes down. We're on. We're down to Drake and Josh. And let's see if I can. Let's see if I can finish it off. I feel we're about to turn the page to the epilogue of this story. Yes, we are. So it uses Shadow Ball before I get the chance to. Ouch, that's gonna hurt. Oh, lived it. Nice. Now I'll retaliate with a Shadow Ball of my own. Ooh, close match. But I am the winner. Deal with it. And I leveled up. Now it's time to battle Team Plasma. Wow, I'm dumbstruck. I know a lot of words, but I can't right now. So let me say this. My feeling is you're a great trainer. Here's $6,000. Thanks, Chantal. Challenger, if you defeat the entire Elite Four of the Pokemon League, you can go on to challenge the champion, and you have earned that right. Return to the plaza in the center and check to the statue. Thanks, Chantal.